thanks for joining us on the, on the post-segment part of our discussion on how in the world do we at Big Take Money take such big deer consistently? Well, the answer is we hunt where big deer are. You know, it, a, a hunter to take big deer consistently has to be a good hunter. Now, that's a given. And he has to be willing to hunt hard. That's a given. And you have to go at the best times. That's a given. But the real secret, the, the, the beginning point for consistently taking this kind of deer is to hunt where this kind of deer lives. Now, that means either, you have two choices. That means you either go where they are or you raise them or grow them where you are if you don't have them already naturally and most people don't. Now, to go where they are, what you want to do is go to a place that has relatively low hunting pressure Usually that means large tracts or the fringe of habitat, cold country like in Canada, remote areas where there's just not a lot of hunting pressure, but also a place that has good food sources because you can't grow a big deer if he didn't have good food to eat. So that's the reason South Texas, that's the reason Central Canada, that's the reason Montana have big deer because that's areas that have good food, but they have low hunting pressure, not a lot of people. Big tracts of land, low hunting pressure. The deer get to be old with good food. You put age on a deer, you get a big deer. Now, not everybody has the opportunity to travel to the Peace River of Alberta or to central Canada, Saskatchewan, or to Montana, or to South Texas, where it's very expensive to hunt those big deer in South Texas. It's very commercial there. So a lot of people have to choose the other option, which is grow big deer where they are. And that, that one of the best ways to do that is to implement the take money management system, which is basically increase your nutritional plane, largely through food plots. Don't shoot deer before the time. Give them a chance to get age on them. Be selective in your harvest. Then with time and with effort, you can put age on deer. Give them good food. You'll have big deer. Grow them where you are. More and more people across the country are, are electing to do that. That's what Tecumani is all about, is bringing big deer to you where you hunt and helping you do that. We know it works because we do it. Some of our best properties are the properties that we turn from very poor to mediocre or mediocre properties into great trophy properties because we increased the nutritional plane, we gave the deer great food, and we held off shooting them. Not that they weren't shooters when they're three or four years old and scored 140 or 150, but we knew that if we could get them to five or six years old, they could be 160 or 170, maybe 180. So it takes discipline to do that. It takes hard work to manage and grow these big deer, but it's possible. And many people throughout the country have the opportunity to do that and change their hunting lot where they hunt through management. That's what management's all about, is increasing your odds of taking more and better deer than you ever thought possible, and you can do it through management. I like to go where big deer are to the remote areas, and I like to hunt them there. Many of these deer were killed in Canada, Montana, uh, Midwest. I mean, I've been all over for big whitetails. Wherever they are, I've gone after them. You can do it anywhere if you give them great food, then give them the time to grow old and big. I've done it all over the country. I've raised big deer, grown big deer on properties throughout the country, but I love hunting them everywhere. But my greatest satisfaction comes from growing them where I am on my own property because I know that I had a hand in growing that trophy. Bag.